Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of One Shot. This is the first video is being processed right now. As you just saw. Hey. Nico's having a dream. I did a little reading just to find out if you can open the beds. If you can like get on the bed immediately. Or what? If you can open the game immediately after doing the bet, go Nico goes to bed. It sounds like you can, but I also read that Nico it has underterm in gender, basically, and a lot of, is often referred to with they them. So, sorry, Nico. Just like Frisk. Avery, I had another dream. Did you see this one too? Yeah, I was in a big field, like the one in my last dream. And I saw my village. But then I woke up. Uh, I don't think that this think this world has anything like that. I mean, big wheat fields. The only big plants I've seen here are a bunch of weird trees. And those balls of moss floating in the water. Wait, is moss even a plant? I don't know. Say, have you seen a wheat field before, Avery? Yes, not up close, but... Oh, they're really pretty, aren't they? The one around my f village goes around for miles. The plants are really tall. Sometimes I can't even see through them. When it's windy out, the wind can make waves in it. It's like an ocean. Of food! Oh wait, but there's food in regular oceans too. Like fish or crabs. I'm vegan. I... I've never be actually been to a real ocean until now, actually. Me neither. Oh! I guess we have that in common, Avery. Well, not really. Technically I have, but like... But you're kind of seeing the ocean now? In this world, anyway? As for me, I've seen them on TV before. I never thought I'd get to ride a boat through one. The water back home doesn't have glowy stuff like how it is here, either. Uh, but I guess it's because the world is already so dark. You know, I used to be scared of the dark, Avery. It's a little hard to imagine that now, after spending so much time here. But not, lo not long ago, go. I couldn't even go to sleep without a lamp. I'm still that way. Me too. Really? Even though you're a god? Yeah. I see. Oh, but it's a good thing I got over that fear. Otherwise, I wouldn't last long here. Then again, I've been carrying around the sun, so it's not too bad. And also, I don't feel scared at all with you guiding me. So, thanks for that. Anyway, maybe we should head out now, Avery. Yeah. I found the pen, sort of. Please write your name here. Good luck. Wait. I'm going to look at that place that had the water purification stuff, because... It must be understood. That's how science works, not how ma it is how math works. No, I'm not going to need to, s to snark about Christianity. Like, it was the Holy Spirit thing. Have a nice day! You too! Like, it seems like it's unclear what they are. Hello, person. Welcome to the research station. Hello! Are you sent here by Dr. Silverpoint? No? Oh, carry on then. Anyway, enough about religion. Let's talk about abortion, a much less contentious topic. <laughs> I am in charge of collecting the moss samples. Cool! Oh, I'm not. Okay, I'm going to stop talking. I'm the generator maintenance unit. Everything is fine here. Yes. Hello. Phosphor trees are now being protected under new the new laws. Please do not harvest them. I'm not? Oh, phosphor trees are... Phosphor tree growth has been reduced as of late. Do they use the phosphor or do they produce the phosphor? Hello, living person. Hello. I have collected a duplicate water sample. Would you like it? Um, my program 
Ming says that, that organic beings le need water to survive, so I shall offer it to you. I'll, uh, sure, we'll take it. Hey! Tube of water. Meat mop water collection project resuming. Yeah, note to self, that is definitely a good thing to do. Okay, that's the anomaly. Hey, did I talk to you? Phosphor trees are now being protected. Yeah. Let's hurry out to the new place. Gotta go fast. Clovers. Good luck! Oh yeah, now let's go. Further on. Oh fuck! What in the world? I'm going- We're going to run. Run, run, run! Oh god, oh god, oh god! I mean, I don't know. And now... We've come further on. Wow. This is a city. Ah, the sun! Hello, Messiah. Welcome to the refuge. Do you understand what you must do here? I'm supposed to go inside the tower, right? I already see the sour tower, so I guess we must be close. Where's the entrance? On the surface. The surface? Look down, soft mole one. Oh, we're pretty high up. I guess I gotta get down a lot of stairs. Or find an elevator. Correct. However, the tower is a sacred place. Finding the entrance may be easy, but that alone will not be enough. What do you mean? Once you reach the surface, I recommend visiting the library for these. Alright, thank you. Off you go then, I wish you luck. I'm afraid this area is off limits for you. Only the bearer of the sacred kernels permitted access to the garden. Is it this? Oh, like a kernel of corn? I have this! It was left behind by the plant lady in the glen. That is indeed the colonel. Then, it is your duty to regrow her. Do you understand what you must go? Ah, uh, no. Take the seed to the garden. Plant it in the pot in the center. You may now pass through here to access the garden. I can put the seed in the planter. There's no dirt in this pot. Will the seed really grow like this? Well... I don't think it will. Okay. Now we gotta find dirt! Dirt, dirt, dirt. Where is dirt? I wonder if we can ask the... Hello again, Messiah. Do you need help? Well, no. Off you go, then. Off you go. Come on! Come on! Work already! Huh? What was that? Hey, you're a big person. Come on! Come on! I'm too busy for this! Uh, excuse me? Whoa! You're... you! Ah, oh, jeez, I didn't think I was gonna run into... This is embarrassing. Er, is there, uh, anything I can help you with? Yes, please! I would like to know how to get to the surface. Yeah, I was afraid you were gonna say that. Right now, this elevator's the only way to access the surface, but... Yeah, just take a look at it. It looks like an elevator. Well, you're not wrong, but... Go look at the button panel. Huh? There aren't any buttons. 
Yep, that's a problem. There's usually a big button here that says ground on it. You know, because it takes you to the ground area. But now it's been ripped out, or something. I tried looking everywhere for it, but to no avail. M maybe it exploded? Do you think we'll have to make a new one? What? How? We'll fig figure it out. Oh hey, and now there are the blockages. I'm just... My first priority is looking for... God, were we supposed to get dirt from somewhere? I hope not. It's an empty coffee tin. A coffee machine. It's nearly full. Oh, hi there. Hello. How come there aren't any people here? Normally cafes have tons of people. Yeah, it's a really slow day. Do you think it's because of the ground the ground axis elevator is broken? So I've been told. The city's infrastructure has been suffering a lot lately. Skywalks and stairs breaking off left and right. Now the only re reliable way of transport are those elevators. Until now, anyway. A coffee machine. It's nearly full. Milk and sugar. I like both. But not in coffee. Is that because you don't like coffee, or because you like it black? I actually... Honestly... Cold coffee can be okay with both cream and sugar, but with one of the two, it's disgusting in my opinion. Okay. Dirt, dirt, dirt. Hey, there's a bed. That's important, at some point. Hmm. What is this place? Locked. Locked. Are you- are you an intruder? Because if you are, then I- Model 8XM, home security bot, yeah, trademark. Serial number, I'm not reading that. We'll have to report you. Oh, sorry, I kind of just, just walked in because the door wasn't locked. Do you want me to leave? Scanning for suspicious activity. Suspicious activities detected, zero. Well, I guess as long as I don't do anything bad. Uh, there, what's this? A landscape painting. An abstract painting. Not gonna mess around with that. Hey, person. Okay. It's a wall of family photos. Oh. It's a penguin thing. It's a big penguin plush. Hello, penguin. Hello. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's horrifying. Avery, someone lives here, we can't just sleep in their bed. <laughs> yeah. I don't think either of us are that cool. A painting of four robots playing cards. A picture of many zeros and ones. Hello, would you like to play a game? Oh, sure. What game would you like to play? Hmm. Do you not have paper scissors? Desired difficulty level? Huh? Desired duration of turns? Huh? Uh, please set your timer. Never mind. My parents are, like, literally never home, but I don't mind. I'm used to it. Besides, I've got model C-WT C second gen unit 4E here to keep me company now. She still talks a little weird sometimes, but that's okay. She's learning. If I worked real hard, she might even be tamed someday. I keep hearing that word. What, tame? Mm-hmm. Nobody's told me what it means yet. That's just a robot thing. I can't really explain it either. Ah. A pile of large books. One of them is a robot instruction manual. It's off. This place is sad. It's a landscape portrait of the Glen. A picture of a ram wearing a little pink bow. Something has been chewing on this plant. I just moved here from the Glen. Things are so different in the city. You've been to the Glen, right? Yeah. Everything's so green back there. I really miss it. My neighbor gave, gave me some plants to cheer me up, but... 
I should probably get a muzzle for Betsy here. Don't be mean to the animal. The title is City Life. What to expect? Hey. The entire plant was eaten. Of a potted plant. Okay, I need to find some dirt or coffee grounds, I think. Things are so different. Hello. I'm not sure what this is. It's like a little car. Resist the urge to ride on it. I wasn't going to, Avery. <laughs> yeah. I c I'm not gonna... I'm definitely not going to act like... Yeah, I'm quite fine with those words being put in my mouth. Wow. Hello there. You have a lot of plants. I do! Grew all of these myself, you see. Feel free to ask me about them. Oh, you're a gardener, right? Yep. Do you happen to have any dirt? For growing plants, I mean. Yep. Do you need some? Yeah. I'm supposed to plant this seed left behind by a plant lady, but the pot in the garden doesn't have any soil. I see. I know you who, who you're talking about. Yeah. Here, take this whole bag. Thanks. Most of the plants in our world tend to grow in the glen, even if it... Even if it's facing the flooding issues, it's still in better condition than the other two areas. The Barrens as well. The Barrens. And Refuge City barely has enough ground to stand on, let alone grow stuff. On a larger scale than this, I mean. Filled with plant clippings. A watering can. It's half full. No, that's not the right way. Yay! I had faith that finding dirt would lead to good things. And it did. Maybe I should let me go. No. There's no dirt in this pot. Will the scene really grow like this? I hope this helps you grow, little seed. The seed's in the soil, but it looks a, li a bit dry. Good thinking, Avery. Water should help the seed grow. Hmm, the dirt's nice and moist now, but what if it dries out? There's only so much water from this little tube. I'll hold on to the tube for now, just in case. I'm gonna look for a watering can. Let's see if I can ask him to borrow the water and can. <sighs> I believe it's this one, right? I hope this is the right one. Good luck with that seed now. Watering can is half full. It's a sink. Right, I can refill this tube with more water here. It's a sink. Okay, I would have done the coffee ground. Okay, I wish I could go. S I wish Nico could ride a train to there or something. Nimby Rails! It makes me like trains more. Nimby Rails is a game with trains. And it has a lot of modding potential. Which makes sense for a game about trains, I think. Yeah, if only the... Well, yeah, the world might... Given dirt and water, but will that be enough?
again. Okay. Yeah. It seems like we might want to get fertilizer. Hello again, Desire. Do you need help? Well, very well. You need to find a way to get to the library on the surface. I need to investigate the rest of this area. Don't want to leave an area unexplored, after all. It has been 20 minutes. Eh, let's go a little longer. The door is locked from the inside. Strange. Maybe. I mean, it's a game made in RPG Maker, so... Uh, where? Soap dispenser. It's a sink. A small potted plant. Okay, scissors. There's a pair of scissors on the ground. On a pile of hair? I don't think anyone's using it anymore, so... Hey, scissors. I'm guessing it's... Yeah, some of the people in here are relatively tall. cups. I'm too young to drink coffee. It's a photograph of the cafe. Looks like it was a busy day. Rhyming is wonderful. Hey, TV person. Hey there. Hello. You the messiah? Mm-hmm. I like your scarf. Thank you. Mama made it for me. Tell her I like her needlework. I will. When I see her again. It looks like I can unlock this door. Okay, there we go. Just a trash can. Wow. This... This fridge has magnets on it. Maybe they'll come in handy? I hope nobody will mind us taking them. Magnets. I can't combine those. I need to... F Pile of large books. They look like fun books. That might be relevant at some point. I don't know. It's nice of them... Okay, so this part of the area is... Wait, have I gone in all these? Yes, I've gone in there. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I've been in all these. Oh, I could've taken the shortcut. This sounds like a remix of the out outdoor theme, the indoor theme. This feels kind of final, but I don't know if it is. Oh, that's bed. The, the button says ground, I think. I seem to remember there being some sort of puzzle related to it. You know, the tall gate came here, came in er here earlier saying the same thing. He asked me if I've seen a button that says ground on it. He looked pretty stressed, so I wanted to cheer him up. I told him, him the only ground I've seen today is coffee grounds. He, um, he didn't get it. Look at sugar, not coffee. Coffee machine. Hey, could I get some coffee grounds? Just the whole pot of coffee and rush back. Yeah, it really takes his job. It's an important job, but nothing is worth that. What does he do? Maintenance, I believe. Something to do with the lights, but I don't know. Maybe you can ask him. 
Oh, you're still here. Would you, um, like anything? I can cook something for you if you want. It's alright, thank you. I'm surprised you're not hungry, Nico. Hungry person. I mean, I'd probably be a hungry person after this long, especially running all over the place. Okay, let's see what's over here. Good afternoon. Well, the time of day doesn't really mean anything now. With the sun go on, the night never seems to end. Then, how can you tell? Time, I mean. I have my ways. Nearest precious, please do cherish it. I will. That is... Dangerous room. They are just bolted, so... A stain killer. It's bolted to the table. Tape dispenser. It's bolted to the... They are just bolted so people won't seal them. Feel free to use them, though. Some kind of computer terminal. I'm the power room mechanic. Do you have an issue to report? Yeah, actually. The surface access to this elevator appears to be broken. There's a button missing, and... Can you go take a look? Leaving this room is not in my programming? Ah, never mind. I think I know the general solution. Oh, maybe we can make a button out of this. I can cut out a piece of the can and fold it into a rectangle shape, just like Arx and Craft. Hmm, I don't think it's supposed to be this simple. How are we going to connect it to the elevator? Well, let's find out. The magnets don't stick to the aluminum, but... Oh, what if I just fold the magnets under this edge? Hmm, it's falling together, just barely. I hope that's good enough. Oh. A stapler. It's bolted to the table. Tape dispenser. Oh, of course. I gotta tape it together or it might fall apart. Good thinking, Avery. Taped button. The magnets are secured with tape. Okay, I feel like there's something more to this. Okay, over here. Oh, boy. A heavy piece of metal... For some kind of fault. There's a small screen here in the middle. This area is unsettling as shit. Holy heck. Oh. Wow. I've actually never been to a big city before. All these lights. All these people. I guess most of this world's population lives here. Whoa! Careful on the railing! It's very different from my village. The village is very small and surrounded by huge fields. You saw a bit of that in one of my dreams from a while ago. The tallest buildings in our village are only two stories tall. Uh, actually, I'm going to finish this, then end the video. What about you, Avery? Where do you live? A city. A city? Like this? Wow. I can't imagine living in a city. Well, technically a suburb. More a suburb, but it is a city. It must be exciting, and kind of scary. The view is nice, though. I wish I lived in a big city density like this. Oh, is that a looping place? Oh. This place is... I mean, maybe it's... There's something else to it. Computer. You're going to need this soon. Take this film and expose it to the void. The answer will be revealed when you bring it back again. The computer pr printed out a really stra a strange transparent sheet. Still clueless? Figures. Want another tip? Yeah. There's a void beyond the four walls that bind our world to yours. The edges of your viewport. Port where everything is obscured. I'm sure you'll know what I'm talking about. Pass the film through the void and back again. You were testing my patience. No. Are you just here to waste more of my time? Sorry. Sorry, I didn't mean to...
Oh. Okay. Well, that's it for this episode. Full screen. Off. Well, see y'all next time. Bye!